I am Anil Kumar and now let us explore the properties of roots of quadratic equations. The question here is find the equation whose roots are squares of the roots of 4x square minus 9x minus 2 equals to 0. Right? Now let us say x1 and x2 are roots for this particular quadratic equation. In that case what is going to be the sum of roots? x1 plus x2 will be minus b by a. So that will be 9 over 4. Correct? So that is x1 and x2. And how about the product? x1 times x2 will be equals to c over a which is minus 2 over 4 or I can write this as minus half. So these are the sum and product of the given roots. Now we need to find equation whose roots are squares of the roots of this function, right? So the roots for that is x1 square and x2 square. So these are the roots of our new equation and that is what we need to figure out. Now if the roots are x1 and x2 square, then we need to find their sum and product, correct? Now how to find their sum? So we can add them up, right? So if I add x1 square plus x2 square, what do I get? Now we know x1 plus x2 is 9 over 4, but how to get x1 square plus x2 square? So we'll apply a technique. That is, we can write this as x1 square plus x2 square. Now we know 2ab, if I add and subtract, that means what I'll do is add 2 times x1 x2 and subtract 2 times x1 x2 then what do we get in that case we can factor right this becomes a perfect square which could be written as x1 plus x2 whole square and we get the next term as minus 2 times x1 x2 so that's the technique which helps us to find the answer now we know what is x1 plus x2. x1 plus x2 is 9 over 4. So we can replace this by 9 over 4. That becomes 9 over 4 whole square minus 2 times x1 x2 is minus half. Minus half. Do you get it? So that is how we can kind of simplify it. So that gives us 9 over 4 squared is 81 over 16. And here we have minus minus becomes plus plus 1 right so this could be simplified it is 81 plus 16 over 16 and that gives us 97 over 16 so that is what the sum of these two roots is now let's find the product of these x1 square times x2 square will give us product so that is x1 x2 whole square correct so x1 x2 is minus half so we can write this as first let me write this as x1 x2 whole square and you know x1 x2 is minus half so it is minus half whole square which is equals to 1 over 4 so we get that value since we know sum and product of these roots we can write down the quadratic equation right so the quadratic equation now becomes x square minus sum of the roots which is 97 over 16 x plus product of roots which is 1 over 4 equals to 0. It is always good practice to write it in integer forms right. So we'll multiply everything by 16. So what we get here is 16 x square minus 97 x plus 16 divided by 4 is 4. So we get 4 equals to 0. So that is the equation we are looking for. Right? So that is our answer. I hope you remember the formula which we used. And that is equation of a quadratic function is x squared minus sum of roots, right? Times x plus product of roots. equals to zero right so that is how we can 
find the answer. The trick here is at this stage. So when the roots are squares, in that case what you can do is you can add and subtract 2x1, x2, kind of make it a perfect square and then it becomes simpler to solve. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.